Hey there, folks. I'm Eric Osberg with the Outdoor Report. I'm here with Willie. Say hey, Willie. Hey. And uh, we're going to show you how we rig up to go sucker fishing. Get him up there. Yeah. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. We got it. Oh, he came off right away. We're lucky we got him when we did. Otherwise, he might have struck in the hook. First sucker of the year, buddy. Yeah, you definitely cannot lick them. His mouth. Don't drop him. I'll try to. He's going to squirm. Should I get a picture? Yeah. You know for their size, they're strong. All right, should we let them go? There could be hundreds more down there, but we can't see them. So finally let them go right here? Yep. This is an awesome fish. There he goes. Out into the blue. Good job, buddy. Here's the basic setup. All you're gonna need is, is a rod, any rod will do. I actually, I prefer to use low end rods because when you're trouncing around in the woods, uh, you're getting snagged on stuff, I don't, uh, I don't wanna break one of my high end rods. So, so anyway, so here's the, uh, you can use a high end rod if you want. So here's the setup. All you're gonna need are some of these Snells. They come pre-rigged. The, I got these at Walmart for a dollar. And then you need a variety. I use egg sinkers. What's that, Willie? Of weights. Of weights, yep. So I use egg sinkers. Um, I like to have a half ounce, three quarters ounce, and a full ounce. So that way, depending on how much current there is, you can make sure that you're staying on the bottom. And then you're gonna need some clips you can use whatever kind of clips you want heavy duty clips are best um, and then basically you just first thing you do is you you tie on the, the egg sinker and then you run that down to your clip and then you just snap these snells on there and the reason I like to use these snells is number one they're they're cheap they're like I said a buck you get six of them for a buck number two if you bust off you just clip another snell on there so um and then basically you just throw it out in the river and you can hold it or you can just stick it in the mud or stick it in a stick or i was gonna say stick it in a y stick stick it tell them about the y stick what's the y stick so you sort of it's sort of like a rod holder you find a stick that's shaped like a y you stick it in the mud and it's exactly like a rod holder I don't know. It might be. I think it's a bass. What is that? What is that? It's a sucker. There you go. Nice That's a nice one. one. Here. It's a much bigger one. Yep. You got it. So what? How was the day today? What did you do? We went fishing. Three ammonite fossils and got a sucker. Does it feel good to be outside? Yes. How's that sun feel on your shoulders? Good. Good. All right, should we go? Yep. So anyways, that's our setup for uh, for sucker fishing. Um, hopefully soon we can uh, catch a bunch and I'm gonna I'm gonna try to figure out how to smoke them. So that's it. Get boss hog. Get boss hog, yeah.